Welcome back my friends today to another exciting episode of Will It Run It? Today what I'm going to try to do is run this here Best Tech 500 watt pure sine wave inverter. I'm going to try to run my mini fridge that's been featured in so many of my other Will It Run It videos. So uh, and I'd like to try and see if I can get it to run on this lithium uh, lithium iron phosphate battery 256 watt hour uh, but first to even see if the inverter is up to the task i went ahead and used the included cables to clamp it directly onto my jeep wrangler's battery so here goes this uh the mini fridge just it, it it hasn't been plugged in for a few days now it's definitely the compressor's cooled down so it's it's ready to go i'm gonna go ahead and get this plugged in and then let's kick it on, see what happens. Okay. Uh, I heard the compressor vibrate on it. There was no beeping. Oh, looky there, it didn't do it. If I'm unable to start it up with the Wrangler's battery, then there's no way I'm gonna be able to do it on this Life LifePo 4 battery it's not necessarily a test the battery it's a test of the inverter what i mean is if i plug this inverter into this lifo battery now it's not going to start it either so on second thought i'm not quite ready to admit defeat yet so one of the problems that i have with these uh these little clamp styles is they're they're really not i mean they clamp they clamp down nice and hard but there's really not a lot of surface area contacting that battery terminal so uh, I do have these, and, and those are probably 10 gauge wire, I think. These, I believe, are eight, uh, either eight or six. And I do have uh, terminals that can be clamped down on both sides. So now I know that it's on there solid. I'm gonna give this thing another go. So I've got it hooked up uh, to the LifePo 4 battery now. If it, Let's just see if this works. If it doesn't, I can try this again on the uh, on the Wrangler battery, but here goes. So this thing has been sitting for a few minutes. The compressor should be nice and cooled down. Kick it on. Okay. The fridge is kind of making some rumbling. I don't think it's doing it. Nope, it didn't do it. It didn't do it. So one thing I want to point out is I have a Jackery 500 and it runs this very fridge without a problem. And it has a, the Jackery 500 has a 500 watt hour lithium battery and a 500 watt pure sine wave inverter. So either all inverters aren't made equal and this is uh, barely uh, able to kick off 500 while the Jackery can put out a solid 500 or it's because I'm still using this LifePo 4 battery that uh, is only a 256 watt hour. It may not have the cranking amps to get that thing started up. So I'm gonna do one final test, which is going to be to clamp these down to the, uh, the Wrangler battery so that I know that's a solid connection, not just a clamp on kind, but actually screwed down tight. And then if it, if it doesn't start there, then I'm gonna say that the fault is the best tech. So stick around, let me try that. Alrighty, it has been a couple minutes. I've now got it hooked up. I've got it clamped down to uh, the Wrangler battery, the plus and the minus, going back up to the inverter, plus and minus, eight gauge wires. The compressor has had some time to cool down, so let's fire it up and see what happens. I don't think it's gonna do it, because I can feel the Nope, I could feel this thing. I could feel the fridge trying and trying and trying and trying and just not starting. So there we have the answer. So the we still don't know if this has got enough cranking amps to start the compressor. All we know is, because I know that battery definitely does have enough, so we know that this Best Tech 500 watt pure sine wave inverter is not good for running a mini fridge. The Jackery 500 watt inverter that's built in, uh, to, built into the Jackery is sufficient to start it. So that tells you that there is a difference in quality in inverters pure sine wave inverter the jackery and this both have a pure sine wave inverter so we should be comparing apples to apples this is clearly a weaker unit hey this wouldn't be a good video without some sort of a control group right so in the past we did try in a, in a prior video i tried starting the mini fridge with this 750 watt uh, assumably modified sine wave inverter so just to show you that it can be done 
I'm going to go ahead and hook this up, or I've got it hooked up to the Wrangler's battery. I'm gonna fire it up, show you that it can start the compressor. Then I'm gonna go ahead and get those wires moved down to my uh, lithium battery and see if it'll do it. That way we can indeed test if that lithium battery has enough oomph to start a mini fridge. So here it goes, turn it on. And the fridge is running. It didn't even make a beep. I think last time I did this on the Kia one, it actually beeped upon startup, but uh, this one didn't. You can hear the fan running. It's got a noisy fan, but I can tell you that the uh, mini fridge is running. I can hear it running. I don't know if you can hear that in your video. So it did start it, it is running. So I'm going to get it shut off and I'm gonna give it a, a, a yeah, I, I felt the compressor shake down on it. I'm gonna give it a few moments here to cool down. And then uh, while I get these wires moved over to the lithium battery, and then let's see if the lithium battery can start it. We are now ready to test it. I got the 750 watt modified sine wave cheap inverter hooked up to the lithium battery pack. Here goes. Nope, couldn't do it. This, uh, the fridge did vibrate but it did not start up and i have a feeling that uh, this thing its overload protection probably clicked in because it's uh it's saying fault right there so there you have it it will not run the original test that i did was will this run on a best tech pure sine wave inverter the answer is no it still runs on the 750 watt modified sine wave inverter the cheap one i've had for many years and, and question number two will this run on the uh, lithium battery pack and the answer is no now i if i had two of these and i set them up in um, parallel parallel right yeah parallel uh that would be another question but i only have one of these batteries i'd like to order another one because i actually need uh, uh probably two more of them for a project that i'm working on but they are not currently available unfortunately amazon sold out of them i guess so uh, i'm watching and i'm checking every couple of days and if i see one on there i'll make another order maybe i'll make another video at that time subscribe to my channel if you want to see more interesting will it run it videos like this uh, otherwise uh, give me a thumbs up on the video if you liked it and have a great day